Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and uh, if you are new to this channel then make sure you click the subscribe button below so that you could get our latest updates regarding many shares try it out guys it would be very very nice and the first thing is that Ujivan small finance man we are going to see about this in this video fully so the first basic thing is that I think one of the best small finance bank IPOs to be listed in market was this Ujivan small finance bank and the second important thing is that the book value of the share was around 11 rupees now after this Q3 results this book value is now at 17 rupees guys 17 rupees it's a very very important growth in this book value and also they are having a various branches across India. So the next important point is that there was a talk like Ujivan Small Finance Bank Limited is aiming for an international banking license which could help to diversify the products that Ujivan Small Finance Bank is trying to deliver to its customers and also they could be able to reach out to various customers and also it could give a boost to the shareholders who have invested in the price of 30 to 37 definitely it is a long term hold we already said it is a long term hold but the main impact in the share is that is that the amount of price it can rise and the duration you have to wait so that is the main point note guys and the first we think we, we thought that this share can deliver to the range of 58 rupees but after the Q3 results we have changed our target to up to 60 or 62 rupees from 60 to 62 rupees that would be the better area for the share to move forward because I think a better suitable price to pay for Ujwan Small Finance Bank would be that price or the IPO price so speaking about the IPO guys uh, each and every company which raises fund using IPO has to submit to the regulatory regarding the amount which they use and this is the official listing by Ujivan Small Finance Bank regarding it and they have said that the company has to file the utilization of funds raised under the IPO of the bank. So what they have said is they have raised their fund to the public issue and what was the main reason was entire amount has been utilized to meet the future capital requirement of the bank there is no amount and spent so the amount they have raised is around 7459 million in which they have spent each and every amount that has been raised and the reason for their usage is that future capital requirement so because of this what can improve you ask guys the capital adequacy ratio or CRAR to be precise for small finance banks would definitely improve and uh, there is no question that Ujman Small Finance Bank's progress is not boring because Ujman Small Finance Bank progress is very very good and the main thing is that the growth it provides the shareholders to the book value because the price it is trading is around the 2 or 3, 2.5 times to its book value and the P ratio is mildly high. So if the book value also increases there would be no much volatility in this stock and it could help the share to go even further up and provide a better valuation for so much of investors who have invested in this share guys. And this is about Ujivan Small Finance Bank and if you have doubts regarding any of the shares leave in comments below so that we could able to post a video about that and see another video very soon. Thank you. Welcome.